5.2, the identity matrix I. So this is going to be a fairly, fairly quick video, it's nothing too complicated this. Um, basically we've got to understand that, the, that um, any matrix times by the identity matrix is the same as the identity matrix times that matrix. So that that's, in that sense it's commutative. Um, multiplication of matrices is generally not commutative, but when you multiply by the, the identity matrix you end up just with the same matrix. So A times I is going to be the same as I times A, and that's just A, because the identity matrix doesn't actually do anything. It just keeps everything the same. So um, we have a, a matrices here, A. We've got to show that A squared equals I. Now the identity matrix is 1, 0, 0, 1, and that will uh, keep everything the same if you multiply it by anything. So let's have a look at uh, A squared. So A squared is going to be that times by itself. Okay, so we end up with now to show it, we've got to be, we've probably got to um, put a bit, bit of detail in here. So normally I would just put the answers, but then again, you're going to end up with I. So you could just write 1001, zero, zero, one, but you need to show it. So we're going to put 0 times 0 plus, and then we've got 1 times 1, and then the second. Let's just, just recap on this again. Um, went through this in the um, the previous video, 5.1, how to multiply matrices. So if, you, if, you, if you're a bit rusty on that, have a look at that first. So we're doing 0 times 0 and 1 times 1. So we're picking these two elements and we're multiplying by these two. And then we're going to add the results like I've done there. And then I'm going to do the same with these two. So I'm going to take these two and then multiply this one again by those two. So 1 times 0 plus 0 times 1 and then we've got um, not sure I'm going to space let's just read that line out there um, and then we've got the second part where we just do the same thing but to these two so we've got 0 times 0 1 times that so we've got 0 times 1 and 1 times 0 so we've got 0 times 1 plus 1 times 0 which is going to be 0 but we'll come to that and then we've got 1 times 1 plus 0 times 0 and that equals um, that is 0 plus 1 this is 0 plus 0 that is 0 plus 0 and that's 1 plus 0 which equals i so that's shown that a squared equals i okay so show that ab is 24i so we just go more play b and then we 24i is equal to 24, 0, 0, 24. So we've just got to show that. So A, B, um, 0, 4, 2, minus 1, times by 3, 6, 12, 0. So again, let's, let's spell it out. So we end up with 0 times 3 plus 4 times 6. Then we've got 2 times 3 plus um, minus 1 times 6, 2 times 3, plus minus 1 times 6, well that's just minus 1 times 6. And then we've got the same on this, this column, so we've got 0 times 12, plus 4 times 0, not oh, in that space, and then 2 times 12, minus 1 times 0, and that gives us um, 0 plus 24 24. Um, 6 take away 6 is 0. 0 plus 0 is 0. And 24 take away 0 is 24. And that's 24 um, times 1, 0, 0, 1, which is 24i. Okay, so that's just understanding that's the identity matrix is 1, 0, 0, 1. And it has no effect on matrices. Um, if you use it and I think the only way it's going to really test what you understand is do you know that the I stands for this matrix so that you can prove that it's that something equals that or a multiple of that in this case so there we go the identity matrix I